happened was we'd gone to Ron McGovern's uh, parents' house where he was living, and she, they had a uh, uh, little area. I don't even know what you call it because I'm not a realtor. But, you know, when you have a bunch of condos next to each other, there was like a driveway that went back, and there were several houses that were duplexes that were yeah. lined up down the street. And so Ron had his own uh, duplex with a, a garage that we had. Uh, for rehearsing and, and I went in there and I set my stuff up and I was just tuning my guitar and and um, I came in and I said okay so you know are we gonna do the audition they said no you got the, the job and, and I was just warming up so I think what they heard pretty much impressed them to the point where they didn't need to do that yeah. and James wasn't playing guitar at the time too I don't right. know if you've seen those pictures of him where he's got his mic stand and I'm the only one with the guitar. Mm -hmm. So it was a pretty, pretty big load to take being the only guitar player in a band.